Hey guys, so it's me again. So I said a couple of episodes ago that that was the last of that glitchiness that we had to put up with. But unfortunately, about halfway through this episode, it starts happening again. I am so sorry about this. I'm going to have to edit it in the same way, which I really hate that this has to be your viewing experience, but I really can't find a, a better solution. I have re-exported the footage, I have looked at it over and over, and it seems this is just the way it was recorded. So, for the next episodes... So for the next few episodes, um... What sucks is that we record these... What sucks is that we record the footage several weeks in advance, so... By the time I saw that this was happening, even with that last session, we had already recorded about three or four more ahead of it. The good news is I have looked through the next couple of sessions and I have not seen the glitchiness happening in those. The next few episodes, it's gonna be around, and then the end of this case and going into the next case, it looks like it's fine. Anyway, enjoy the episodes the way they are, and thank you for your understanding and your patience. Now it's time to press buttons and talk with Maggie and Brosy D. So, go to the evidence. Um... Present? Oh, on this? Mm-hmm. Now click the hat. What does this say? Now, this was found at the crime scene, but, uh... but go back, go back, go back, go back. He was wearing it the entire time. No, he wasn't. Present the hat, uh, bitch. Oh, okay. I, I gotcha. I gotcha, walkthrough. This wouldn't happen to be the silk hat you saw that night, would it? Yep, that's it. That's the hat he was wearing that night. No question in your mind? Exactly how would one mistake a thing like that? There's exactly one like it in the universe. I see. Is there some sort of problem, Mr. Wright? Ms. Von Karma, where exactly was the silk hat found? Must you always ask these questions? It was found at the crime scene. Z the c c crime scene? That means... How'd you study like that? It's not even the right sound. Shit. Shit. The silk hat fell off at the CC crime scene. However, the witness clearly testified to the contrary. The witness stated that he was wearing it the entire time that he was on the scene. No, that's not true. Got her. Why is that character here? I want to eat that curd. Order, 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 Shove Mr. Curls. E why, yes, your honor. What is the meaning of all of this? You are old enough to know better than to behave like this in court. Hey, that's just not right. That's so harsh. What's not right here is your eyesight and your memory, amongst other things. What? And your stupid carrot. What's your fucking problem? Why are you being so mean to me? What did I do? Let me guess. You just didn't like my jokes or something, right? You didn't have to go and insult my eyesight or my memory. The question? They're both great. Why is that a question? I don't know. Uh, yeah, that doesn't seem like Seriously! That. Why? No matter how old I get, I'm always younger than you! Waaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Objection! No, I'm going to object this time. Mr. Phoenix Wright is badgering the witness, your honor. Objection! My turn. This witness's testimony is so full of holes, Ms. Von Karma's protest is useless. You've got a point. Let's hear what the witness has to say on this matter. Is that all right with you, little guy? Don't talk to me like I'm a little baby. You little stupid baby. Don't talk to me like I'm a baby. Besides, what kind of stupid question is, how did he leave the crime scene? I'm an old man. Oh wait, Phoenix said that. I'm a stupid lawyer. The answer's obvious. He just turned around and walked away. That's what I expected you'd say. You sure that's how it happened? <laughs> huh? I'm not sure I know exactly where you're going with this. Lawyers nowadays sure do love to harp on the smallest things. It's the foot. There's no footsteps. Ah. I mean, I can check it, but... Uh, probably. It's gotta be it. Crime photo. It's the crime photo. Yeah. There's no... There's no... Yeah. What? Right? Uh, yeah. There's no... Right. Yeah. Yeah. There's no I don't no even footsteps. need to check it. Look at this picture. Graph. The problem is the footprints in the snow. Footprints? In this photo, get out of I'm still looking at it. We can clearly see the footprints of the victim. I can't clearly see because you're blocking it. However, where are the criminal's footprints? They aren't there. Ay, 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 ay. I want to see your right. photo. Pass it around. Pass it around. Pass it around. So, Mo, exactly how did the criminal escape the scene? Um, he... Uh... Your Honor, this witness has already proven that his testimony is completely unreliable. I move to strike all of this witness's testimony from the court record. I agree. This clown's testimony is as rickety as the clown car he came to court in from Clown College. Wait just a second! I dropped out of Clown College. Well, oh, that's even worse. You, <laughs> you didn't even pass Clown College. Well, I don't know why I added that. That did not help my shit. <laughs> you guys can't just ignore everything I've said. Fine, fine, I'll tell you the truth this time. We really need to make a law where we, like, kill these people or something for lying. You wait a second. I think you've said more than enough for today. That didn't hurt. Yes, it did. I'm sick and tired of listening to you anyways. I'll give you the real deal this time, I swear. I don't know why, but I get the feeling things are gonna get worse before they get better. Me too, Mr. Lawrence Curls. Yes? The testimony you've provided up until now has been false? It hasn't been false, I haven't lied, it's just... It's just what? It's just... I was a bit confused on the bit about the criminal leaving the scene. Especially since Von Kammer and her whip told me not to talk about what I really saw. What the fuck? That's fucking bullshit. Don't tell him that. Tell, this is tell the truth. I want to know the secret at least. Order, order. I will have order. If I have a whip, I can make people do whatever I want. Francisca Von Kammer. She's so pretty. Don't interrupt me. How could you? <laughs> Sorry, just a song. Just, Sorry, but I, but I am so name. pretty. I'm look at, everybody look at me. Your Honor, if you had heard the truth from this witness, you would have ha you would have exactly the same opinion as I have. What opinion is that? It's not funny. That's enough out of you. I'm going to listen to what he has to say. Now then, let's hear the truth about what you say you saw. Ha! You're not gonna believe this, but it's all true, I tell ya! Try not to waste our time with your idiotic drivel. Damn, they're so mean to this little clone. Cause this clown fucking sucks! Yeah, he sucks. I'd punch him in the face. Now it's time for our next segment! Mo knows! Everything that I've said up until now has been the truth! When I looked out the window, the ringmaster was down and Max was standing above him. He wasn't wearing his white roses that everyone f loves so fucking much, but he was wearing the silk hat. That's when I saw he... What? Well, he went like up and like more up. It's like he got dragged around in paint. 
This is the truth now. Get ready for it. He flew. He jumped up and flew through the air. I'm just making shit up now. <laughs> and then he like, he flew. He turned into bats. He flew right off and disappeared into the darkness. And he the was, bats flew off in different directions. They were all firing lasers and shit. And they said, we're Max, we're Max. There, were, there was fire everywhere. That's why there were no finger footprints. The bats, or fingerprints. Or fingerprints. There weren't any kind of prints. Flying people, flying bats don't leave footprints. Or fingerprints. They burn things. So that was a great story. Are they like keys from Zelda? Is that, <laughs> is that what they are wearing? No, they're not like keys from Zelda. They're like bats from uh, more like uh, Paper Mario swoopers, you know. Oh, I see. Yeah. I told you it wasn't funny. Do you believe me now? Swoopers, huh? Well, that was, um, how do you put this into words? Maximilian Galactica is a world-class magician. But to turn into a million bats, there's no way that actually happened. You... you're right. Why is she right? You believe the other witnesses? Why won't you believe me? Especially since it's the coolest part of the story. Hmm. To be honest, this is the first time I've heard of a flying criminal. What do you think about this witness's testimony, Mr. Wright? Pretty sure it doesn't matter what we say. He's here. telling the truth, probably. Uh, yeah, he's telling the truth. Yeah, I believe the little clown boy. What he just said was so strange. I don't think he would have made it up. Which means that he is telling the truth. That's what I think. Nick, wait. That means Max actually used magic. Yikes! You're right. Fuck. Ow! Stop. Sorry. I. This is fun. Only a foolish-looking fool could be fooled by such a foolish fool's foolish dream. Don't be ridiculous. Magic does not exist, and neither do dreams. Dreams <laughs> exist? <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Excuse me, anyway. I suppose I will let you all in on my thinking regarding this matter. The criminal disappeared into the sky. I'd love to believe that, but I just can't wrap my head around how that could actually happen. You imbecile. If you disregard a need for proof, Ms. Von Karma's case is sound. However, I've got the feeling that this case is in dire need of more investigation. Plus, you need some more health, Mr. Wright. Mm. Thus, I will conclude today's proceedings at this point. It's an undisputed fact that the criminal left no footprints at the scene. Tomorrow, I want us to find out the reason behind this mystery of mysteries. Mystery of mysteries. Um, uh... Grr. Now go to your rooms. I believe that's enough for today. Court is now in recess. All right. We're going to have recess. Phoenix and like Phoenix. The whole day is awesome. Phoenix and Francisco don't get to come because they got sent to the room. They got grounded. Ah. You guys don't know what the recess really means. Hey, sweeties, what in the world is going on? Why are all those men running outside? <laughs> a bunch of adults just running around, not playing anything. It's not like a playground, it's just like the lawn it's in front of the court. It's a just Charlie brought them down. Yeah. Yeah. Waving Who's... their arms. They <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. make their own fun. That's what I want to know. But it does look kind of fun, so... They say the criminal flew off into the air and disappeared and turned into a thousand bats and burned down the forest. Max, I can't believe I'm asking this, but you didn't fly that night, did you? I know you didn't mean to ask me such a fabulously stupid question. I can fly whenever I please. It's not that easy. But it looks so effortless for you on stage. It's not that simple. I'm not actually flying on stage. I use invisible wires and have them hoist me through the air. Wow. You just told me the secret to your magic. Crape Cop, stop recording this. You're not going to put that online, are you? I want to be a magician, man. <laughs> no! I broke the first rule! The cardinal rule! The only rule! You couldn't, like, figure that out? Dude, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> it's invisible wires. Like, I'm sorry, Max. I'm sorry you had to break a magician's creed to keep the magic trick secret. Nick, what do we do now? All we can do now is hope we find the flying criminal in court tomorrow. Great idea. Let's do our best and catch this sucker. 
Oh, Why don't we ever play with them, Nick? Yeah. <laughs> no thanks. They're all like 30 and it's just It's a little weird. sad. There's like a low hum coming from somewhere. What? I don't... Not really. Uh, I think it's like outside. I just hope the mic doesn't pick it up. Ah, uh, it should be fine. If um, not, whatever. Nick? What is it? I've got a confession to make. I'm terrible at figuring out magic tricks. Magic tricks? Yep. Magic tricks are by their very definition tricks, right? But I can never figure out the tricks when I see them. I'm just not good at it. That's because the tricks are performed by pros. They do it so you can't guess the trick. But, but the trick Pearly showed me was incredible. Pearls did a magic trick? Hmm, what kind of trick was it? Let's see. It looked like she pulled the end of her own thumb off. <laughs> First, she put her right thumb next to her left hand, and then it just separated. She could move it up and down and everything. It was incredible. I screamed for ten minutes. <laughs> really? Was it kind of like this? <laughs> <laughs> what? Wow! How do you do that? <laughs> Nick, you're like a real magician. Do you have magical powers? Yes. See, this is why I just can't figure out magic. I'm no good at it. Especially hard tricks like flying away from the scene of a murder. You'll take all the fun out of magic if you keep trying to figure it out. Aw. Blah, blah, good blah, moral. blah, 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 Maybe blah. on the next episode we'll do some investigation and, and not take, take any of these because that's not going to do anything. Yeah, it'll be great. Yeah. We'll uncover the case. Wow.